The American was left bloodied and dejected in his first title defense. Ishan Strickland was left battered and bloodied as his reign as middleweight champion came to an early end. Welcome to my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. For starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button. The controversial American made the first defense of his 185 pounds title on Saturday night in the main event of UFC 297 in Toronto. Both men vowed to deliver a bloody war in the build-up to their Toronto Dussel, and they well and truly made good on their promise. Surging South African Duplessis immediately sought to put the now former champion on the back foot with a mix of forward pressure and takedowns, but Strickland's sharper boxing and front kicks saw the judges give him the nod in the first stanza. DDP got into his groove in the second and third rounds and began to put more venom in his shots but he eventually deviated from the leg kick well he was drawing from early doors after having several of them checked. The former FC2 division champion really turned up the heat in the fourth round, in which he drew blood thanks to a chopping right hand that cut the flesh under Strickland's left eye. Duplessis further solidified the round with a big takedown, although he was unable to do anything with it. Strickland's head coach Eric Nixick made an emotional plea to him ahead of the final round to pour out everything he had left in the tank to save his title. Strickland tried his best to do just that but was unable to land the Hail Mary shot he needed to continue his reign as champion, although it wasn't for the lack of trying. The judges were torn with their verdict, turning in 48 minus 47, 47 to 48, 48 minus 47 scorecards in favor of DDP. Victory over Strickland saw Duplessis become South Africa's first UFC champion and only the continent's fourth title holder in MMA's top promotion. After his historic triumph, an emotional Duplessis roared. This is history, South Africa. Duplessis was full of praise for the former champion, saying, Who says this guy is not a five-round fighter? What did I tell you? He has a super strong jab. It feels like someone's hit you with a rock. It's very deceptive. I knew if I pressured I could get through it. I tried to kill you in there, and you are one hell of a man, Strickland. Attention has already turned to Duplessis, who is now a three-promotion world champion, will face in his maiden title defense. Kamzat Shemaev has already thrown his hat into the ring, calling for a UFC 300 showdown. But unsurprisingly, Duplessis has called out rival Israel Adesanya, who he's been at loggerheads for nearly a year. He said, there's a man who tried to take my shine. He lost his shine, and now I've got his shine. Israel Adesanya, get your ass back in this cage.